Okay, so, hello, um, YouTube people of the world. Um, yeah, this is a trio intro something. Um, and just to preface, this is going to be a fat kid video, so that's it. Just a warning. Um, my name is Brianna, and um, I want to lose weight. And I've been watching the people on YouTube for a long time, more over a year, I think. And just sort of, yeah, I've actually been watching it pretty often. But I find it really motivating and pretty inspiring. And, um, yeah, so I thought I would, um, put my two cents in or give it a shot or see how it works for me. Um, I should have made a list <laughs> so I knew what I wanted to say, but I have been fat kid my whole life. I'm sorry, that might sound a little rude. I've been overweight my whole life. Um... I mean, really, since I was born. And um, I've never really dieted a lot. I have, you know, sort of tried to maybe do more sports and things like this. Um, but I've always, I've still been big. And I guess for a while I was in denial of it. I. I think I got pretty, pretty big. Um, I don't know, a couple years ago, I joined Weight Watchers, and I think I weighed in at around 277, and this was really a big shock for me. I didn't expect that. I hadn't weighed myself in a long time. I mean, years. And um, I, yeah, was really shocked, but more so, about the fact that I was actually two pant sizes smaller than I had been in college at the time I was 277 and so that means that I was probably during school I was probably more like you know 280 290-ish I don't know I have no idea how much a pant size is for me but definitely more and you know I, I didn't take a lot of pictures of myself at that time and when I look at, you know, there are a couple, and I do see that I was pretty big. Anyways, so, um, yeah, right now, um, when I joined Weight Watchers, I lost about 40 pounds, and it was a really great program. I really enjoyed it, but um, I moved out of the country for work, and that's a great experience, but relocating and living in a foreign country is um, you tend to put your food and your diet last on the list and I did that successfully <laughs> very successfully I gained back a lot of the weight and I think I was somewhere around 250 in November of 2009 and now here I am um, been slowly chipping away at my weight and um, I think so we'll say officially today I weighed in at around um, 234 which is great I'm very excited about I, my goal for now for some time in the future is to get down to 210 because I've never in my knowledge crossed 210. I've never seen it. Um, and I'd like to, just to see what it's like. And then eventually I'd like to do more, but that's my first goal is 210. And um, I'm hoping that I can do it on, you know, with the support of, you know, the people in the YouTube community. I've never been a part of a community of any kind, uh, especially when it comes to my weight. It's something that I'm very secretive about and that, I mean, it's obvious you wear it on your skin, but it's something that I just kind of don't talk about. You pretend that you're happy with it. And although I've been heavy my whole life, I've never been happy in my skin, which I'm sure a lot of people can relate to. And I know that there's thin people that aren't 
happy in, in their skin. And I think that's why a huge part of the battle is mental. Um, I also am really, at this point, I'm really focusing on my health. I'm not very old and yet, you know, sometimes I feel like I'm dying. Parts of me are hurting that I didn't know could hurt and that makes me sad. It makes me sad to, to be in pain. It makes me sad when my knees hurt or my back hurts or things like this and the prospects of getting worse and getting, you know, having to do, yeah, I don't know, going to surgery or things like this, it really scares me and I, you know, I want to be able to look forward to a long life and I don't, I don't want to be afraid and yeah. Um, I, I recently had a little bit of heart trouble. I don't think that it was really um, anything serious, but it did make me think that I have poor heart conditioning and I mean, it just all plays into it, it all goes together. And so basically I'm in a really good mental place right now and I know it won't always be like that. I know it will be hard and I know that, um, that sometimes I'll have that old uh, negative feelings that make me want to eat. I am an emotional secret eater <laughs> um, and I really have to focus on getting rid of that in my life and um, yeah and dealing with things as they come and learning how to positively deal with my problems, maybe exercising, um, which I hear a lot of people do to exercise, to get rid of stress, who would have thought of it? Um, yeah, anyways, that is my goals and my plan and my rambling, which I do a lot of, so I apologize. Uh, I think I'm going to try to make a video once a week. Depends on how this goes, if it works, if, um, if I'm completely, yeah, if it works. And tell an update on my weight loss and try to figure out the plan that I'm using and yeah I really look forward to getting to know people and finding support and supporting people and yeah it should be fun yeah and I think I'll get more comfortable on the on the camera and not be so stressed which I don't know if you noticed but I am sort of stressed. I can't look at the camera directly, but I'll try. Um, yeah. So I think that's about it. I'm sure that I've forgotten to say something, but basically I'll be back on here to tell you how much I weigh next week and more if more comes up. So, um, yeah, uh, that's it. I'm done. <laughs>